In this video, I'm going to show you my current book library, that is how many books I've got published, and I'm also going to show you my earnings over the last four months and roughly a week since I started this online business. So let's jump into the Amazon Kindle direct publishing website, which is where everything happens. It's where you upload the books, it's where you can promote them, you can see your income here. This is really where everything happens. So as you can see, I have actually blurred out the covers and I've blurred out the titles of the books just because I don't want everybody to be copying mine and you can come up with your own ideas. I'll show you how to come up with your own ideas. I'll show you where to get ideas from. I'll show you where to take pictures from. I'll tell you where to take quotes from, etc., etc. I'll give you um, endless, endless resources for that. So you can come up with ideas that are probably better than mine anyway. So on page one, you've got 10 books here, 10 per page. So on page two, you've got 10 books. So add them all together. Da, 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 da. 95 pages worth of books. We've got around 950 books published now. Now that's taken four months and roughly a week. And I think if you work it out, it comes to about seven a day. Now that is a that is a fairly good target to aim for. You just got to stay consistent with this book business model and just keep publishing books day after day after day. And you will start to see results compound as I'll show you in a minute with my earnings reports. Now, not all of my books are notebooks or journals like we saw in the previous lecture. So some of them are record books, some of them are log books, some of them are guest books, some of them are puzzle books, etc, etc. But the notebooks are the easiest place to start because the interior, as you saw, is just lines and it's very, very simple to create. It's fast, it's efficient, and they do sell really well. So I would say the majority of my books, probably 70% are notebooks. And that's why I started. And now I'm starting to branch out into other types of books, which I will detail in the course. So now let's jump into the earnings report. So it says here, this year, between April and August, I've earned $2,413. Now, it doesn't seem a lot in four months. That's what, like just over $500 per month. But if we go here, we're going to see the, the graph over time. So April, the first month, this is why I emphasize patience, right? So April, we earned $80. We then jumped to 310 in June, $1,154. Now, the reason for this spike was because in June, we had Father's Day, both in England and in America. So I had a couple of notebooks that reached a really, really high ranking on the Amazon stores. They were selling super, super high. And that explains why June is higher than July, unusually high. July, 637. And August, at the current rate, we should be between 700 to 800. So the graph, if you can imagine where it's going, I'll just do a little demonstration for you. There's there's the first month. There's the 310. There was the big month in June. Let's go down here. That was the that was the thousand dollar month. Thousand dollar plus. And then we had something like this, six hundred and thirty. This month, August, we're expecting something like this. So as you can see, the more books you publish, the more money you make. Obviously, you want your books to be quality, but quantity is is where you're really going to get the scale. So the graph is going to look like this. And in a few months, my income is going to be 2,000, 3,000 in that region. Okay. And the last thing I wanted to show you, again, this is all blurred out because I'm not trying to show my author publisher names is the total so again 2413 1146 sales now if you divide that that's pretty much bang on two dollars per book now again as i said in a future video i'm going to show you the split of the revenue because you don't take the whole 6.99 7.99 whatever price you list the book you don't take the whole thing 